What's up you guys, it's Jade. I'm Kendall. And today we're gonna be showing you how we do our everyday makeup routine, okay? First things first, make sure you got a drink. Mm. You're only gonna look as good as you feel, so you gotta set the mood. Beautiful. I always start with a clear brow gel. I'm gonna start with my brows as well. If you don't have brow gel, you can just use a brow brush with a little hairspray on it. When it comes to filling in your brows, you're really just trying to tint where it's a little sparse. But it also depends on the look of your, that you're going for. If you're going for something dramatic, you're going out to the club, it's a birthday beat, you wanna get your chola brow on, then you fill it in some more. Back in the day, my brows used to be fucked up. I just make sure I clean up my brows. I get an eyebrow trimmer anytime I start. I might use a hair too. And I'm just combing it out in areas that I need to. So, I'll fill them in a little bit. I'm gonna take my spoolie. I'm just gonna brush through my harsh lines like that. I'm gonna brush right up. There are some rules, but as far as play, makeup is art. You do it your way. You do whatever you want. This is just how I do it. Concealer, you could jump in the ocean and this shit ain't going nowhere. Small angle brush. And I have my NARS. I also have my angle brush. I'm gonna do the same. Tiny bit. Down a bit. Liquid products, you need to blend ASAP. Because if not, it's gonna get stuck. So I'm gonna take my blending brush from MAC. And I'm gonna blend it down enough to where it can also kind of serve as a primer for my eyeshadow. Like we said, this is our everyday makeup look, so it's gonna be pretty basic. I'm gonna take my fluffy eyebrow brush from MAC. It's gonna windshield wipe it back and forth. Boom. The best brush at MAC for eyes. The numbers rubbed off, I wish I could tell you. I'm gonna go in with this ash brown right here. I'm gonna use my NARS burnt orange red color. Now, for the lid, I'm gonna take a little bit of this cream. When it comes to mineral makeup, if you wet your brush and you wanna dab on the makeup, you'll see that it's also gonna add a little bit more of an intense color, so I'll show you. I guess I'm gonna wet it a little bit on a little more intense color. Boom. Next thing's next, eyeliner. I'm gonna switch it up today and just do a little bit of a softer, smoky wing. I'm gonna go ahead and do a liquid wing. This is my daily, so nothing new. This is one of my favorites. I just bought this at Hobby Lobby or Michaels at the craft store from the art department. You know, it's a little dark brown. And I'm just gonna smudge out my lash line. So I finished my liner and I made sure they were even, pretty even. Okay. Yeah, when I mess up, I just keep going over it and it ends up this big, so. So it's a fucking. Next, mascara. Curl and um, blink it through. I'm gonna wait to put on my mascara. I'm going to pop on my lashes. I love me some beauty supply glue. Now make sure you ain't getting hit of glue and ripping your shits out. We don't need that. Secure them at both ends. Easy peasy. Okay. While Jade is doing her eye makeup, I'm gonna do my face. And I'm gonna put it on with my sponge that I just moistened in water, just a little bit. This is my liquid foundation from NARS. I'm just gonna use one pump on my brush. It'll cover my whole face. One, two, three, four. Okay. 
After I put on a little bit of my foundation, I'm gonna go in with the concealer. I'm gonna go ahead and add my concealer. So I'm gonna go back in with my double wear. I'm gonna use my lighter powder to go in and set the center of my face. I'm gonna go ahead and get started on my foundation, my powder. I use a sponge under my eyes and pack it in and then I use a brush and lightly go over everywhere else. I have a little leniency on everything else, but when it comes to my face powder, I'm always gonna choose MAC. If you don't give yourself any dimension, go back in there with some extra color. You gonna look like a flat ass bitch. So I'm gonna use my amazing MAC brush and my Studio Fix powder. Go in. It's a little bit darker than um, the one that I used to press the powder in the middle of my face. Bada boom, bada bing. Bam. Now my favorite part of makeup, contour. Alrighty, I'm gonna go ahead and do a bronze. This one is really glittery. So I'm gonna go ahead and just smooth it out with my foundation brush. Okay, so now for the contour, I'm gonna go in with my chocolate brown. Gonna dust it off a little bit. When it comes to contour, you place it where you like. For me, I don't really put it so much in that cut, I put it like matched up to right above it. Okay, so what I'm gonna do for my nose, I'm gonna use the same soft brown that we used in the crease. I'm just gonna use what's left over. I'm not gonna add any new products. So I'm just gonna brush. That's in brown. Okay, cool. Now some lights kinda play with me, but it looks a little more blended in person. Okay, so next. As you can tell, I love this blush. It's a sweet baby pink. It's called Pink Swim from MAC. So, I'm just gonna go ahead and put on my blush. I like a baby pink color. I didn't know what it was, but I think this, this glue smells like stank booty or stank breath. <laughs> and I like the big lashes because I like to be dramatic. Hello. I can't wait to get off this house. <laughs> of goodies from my girl Mika. Touch of Fancy Cosmetics, check them out. Incredible products with a billion colors. If you're a fan of Trophy Wife by Rihanna, this shit right here is Bichwe. You can wet it if you want it to even more. Gorgeous. So I'm just gonna... I'm gonna use my fan brush because it is perfect. I love being extra. I love being extra too. Shining on these niggas. Okay, so now for these lips. Yes, I like to overline my lips. Because I like them motherfuckers to look juicy. And I'm about to use my brand new Touch of Fancy Lip Squeeze. I like my lip gloss to be so juicy that it looks like it's gonna drip off my. You know what? Actually, one time I was in the studio, I was at QC. And I was talking to my friend Steve-O, and I went to the bathroom. I was so fucking embarrassed. I had lip gloss dripping down my chin, and nobody told me. Did you tell me anything? That's before I went to Lucy's birthday party. <laughs> I was so fucking embarrassed. I came back and I was like, Steve-O, why didn't you tell me that I had lip gloss dripping down my chin? And he was like, I thought it was the aesthetic. You can 
always touch me anywhere in the club, in the car, on the job, squeezing some more lip gloss on my shit. So for a final touch, I'm just gonna add a little bit of this Beauty Supply lip gloss right to the center. Now this, when it comes to my lip, I like to use nude, but I like to use it a little bit more on the pink side. I'm sorry. And then I go ahead and use my cheap drugstore clear gloss that everybody should have. So after you put on your lip liner, it's going to look ashy. You're going to move it to glass. Okay, just because we're doing this, might as well add a little more. I absolutely love liquid eyeshadows. So I'm gonna get Kimmel the Bronze. As you see here, I got my cream, I got my champagne, so we're gonna do a little champagne. These are really dope. They look like um, nail polish is. I could put this directly on my eye, but I'm gonna just apply it to my brush so I can smooth it out. Oh my God, I love it. Fuck. I used to go crazy, and I mean taking a shower and setting spray, but I don't really do that anymore. I like to just put it in certain spots. Just for the sake of the video, I'll do one all over spray. Or a few. Spray my brush. And we gon' accent it. I'ma put it pretty much where I put my highlight. And now that highlight will pop. Mm. Okay. And that, my friends, is an everyday look. How you like it? Last touch looking and feeling good. You got to smell good, okay? So I got my Derek Lamb with you, one of my favorites. And some little mysterious shit. That I ain't gonna wear it. Go! I have my Versace, the only perfume I wear. Okay, so that's a wrap. This is just kind of an everyday look, neutral color, so maybe next time we can bring out the color palette and we'll get more fancy and dramatic with it. Cheers! Cheers.